Well, hello there, everyone. <laughs> um, I went grinding for flowers for a little. J just for a little. Um, it actually wasn't as bad as it looks. Um, I... For, like, the majority of my runs to that little forest area, I got, like, two flowers. And then the last time I went through there, I got, like, six. Because there's a little... Oops, wrong place. There's a little spot near the... Right near the end. Where it spawns, like, between... It, it spawns, like, four different items. Each one that you could have gotten from that area. And it turns out, like, oh, hey, all of them were the... Yes, please take all of that. And th you made this. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um, what does the flower necklace do? Well, first of all, I, I need to take off the diamond charm, because it's not useful anymore. Item appearance plus one. This is a drop right item. Uh, I don't think we're going to be doing that. Boy, thank you very much, like, sick child, for for making me a flower necklace. I feel very, very happy. I'm not going to sell it. Um, I'm going to put it in my inventory, or my long-term storage, alongside the actual flower. I'm going to grab that. I'm also going to drop the diamond charm. I'm going to swap it for my star pendant, so I have actual stuff. And the reason why I grabbed this apple, this clearly already eaten apple, is apparently there is somewhere you can... There's a quest chain we've not been doing. As, as if that's a surprise. Um, but apparently there is... I think it's the person up here? Excuse me. Uh, excuse me, old lady. I think it might be this person? While you were out adventuring, I read another book. You want to hear about it? Oh, to do. What? I, what? The monster card. Wouldn't you love to hear those words? Keep collecting. One day it might come true. Let me help you trade with your comrades. He even give me a special card. How wonderful. Um, the, apparently there are. Uh, is this the place? Have you ever had an apple? Nothing tastes better than a bite of one of those. <gasps> hey, is that an apple? Can I have it? Come on, give it to me, please. Yay! Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Here you go. Okay, so you get a little bit of money. Um, the thing is, uh, I think that right now... Like, I bought that from the store. That's, like, a random thing that they'll sell every so often. Um... But that's not the exciting one. Apparently there are, like, four items, which I might have to run back and get, that you can get something that you can use to craft something, and it's... It might be a little too convoluted. Anyway, have a good nap, soup. This is Shining Soul 2, and we're about to go into the, uh, the Dangerous Dungeon. Which, it's not to say that the, that the Mushroom for Forest actually did not turn... Okay, the Mushroom Forest actually turned out to be weirdly difficult, especially the the final encounter in there. For whatever reason, every single time I went through it, I died multiple times and it was <laughs> why. I don't I died more often to that encounter than I have to some bosses. Evil fairies? Uh-oh. Um well first of all, one one nice thing to notice is that they apparently give fantastic experience. The other thing to notice is that they uh, they hit like a truck. So I feel like we okay, I feel like we can do this. Um, but I have to be more careful. Okay, first of all, what are you? Why, why am I getting attacked by putty men? This this is not okay. Um, Look at look at how they walk with such purpose. They're like, do 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 yeah. I am a potty man. Oh my god, there's more. Uh, agree to disagree. 
Oh wow, they uh... I think getting armor was the right choice, or at least it's gonna be the right choice when I finally level up again. Come on! I don't want to spend more items than I have to this early in the dungeon. Come on! The other guys are having trouble hitting me. I will heal tank through this dungeon, by the way. I, I have no shame in doing so. <laughs> oh my god. Um, hmm. I feel like this is going to be one of those things where it's just... My commentary is just going to be like me going, Huh. Huh. <laughs> Why did I think I was powerful enough to take this on again? Uh huh. Okay. At least that putty guy is. can't get to me. Yeah, let's go there so we can see you, you know, trot with purpose. I have a feeling that the game wants me to go the other way to deal with this, but this is safer. Hit like a train. A train made of putty. <laughs> no. Oh no. Okay, we're we're charging that back up. I need these. Oh thank god your pathfinding is terrible. It's always concerning when it's like I get the shield icon and they still dealt like four or five damage. Okay. Doesn't seem to be anything hidden back here. Alright. What's gonna be the last nasty? Okay, we've got fairies, we've got a golem. Oh my god. Yeah, you can't run away. <laughs> I have just I've decreed it that no. Um Oh, I, I wonder if I need to level up Spear, too. Let's cancel that out. Um, hmm. Yeah, because I'm... I, I've chewed through, like, half my healing items already. <laughs> no! Game, please, please, please. I beg of thee. I beg of thee. No! Ah! And ranged enemies who can hit me through the walls. No fair. D did I get all of them? Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. First of all, we we're just like double healing. I don't care. I. These guys are scary. And it's like, it's not like they even have much hit, have many hit points or anything they're just scary because they they paralyze me I do not want to be paralyzed in the face of such aggression especially since these putty people just kick me they're they're like at least the at least the like knight people are like oh we use our double swords or whatever no the putty people are just like yo do you want to be punched to death because I think me and the friend can uh, arrange that. And I'm like, I do not consent. I do not consent to the brutal beating. <laughs> Alright. These guys are less scary. I will be honest. Um, like, I think I can... Yeah, look at that. Look at this. Look at this. Soup is soup is demonstrating the superiority of the spear over everyone else's like pathetic non-spear weapons. Uh, pointy poker superiority. 
And that's going to be useful, because I just got a level up. And you know what a level up means. Um, not only is it more stats, but, uh, do, 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 and do. More importantly, armor up. Okay, we're at 162? 176. Plus 14 armor. Plus 14 defense, I should say. I feel way better about my chances. Or at least I did until these fairies showed up. No, 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 no. Have I have I told you no before? Oh, okay. I accidentally hit the wrong button, but um, that's fine. I have things I can sell. Do I have things I can sell? I think I've got things I can sell. Um. Yep. I... I didn't have... I don't... Wow. They actually did... Huh. And I don't need the... I don't need the good healing item again yet. But, um... Yeah. I... I sure... I could have sworn I picked up something that was... Good to sell. But I haven't. Ooh, this is gonna be nasty. Um... Fortunately, I have time to get into position. Where are we gonna be? There we are! Kill one. Let's... Let's chase you down. Um... I mean, I don't have much to worry about from, like, physical attacks anymore. It's mostly... As you saw, magic attacks can are considered harmful. <laughs> you know, these guys, I have less concern. I have fewer concerns. Um, for a second there, I thought someone was still there. Oh, oh no, we've got, like, the boulder frog again. I still don't know what's up with that character design. Let's wait until we get our full charge. And go around the corner and... Okay, yeah, you didn't... You got too close to me. <laughs> like, I was, I was kind of hoping that this would also just drop really nice equipment, honestly. Like, as it stands and... Oh my god, uh... Like, as it stands, the XP's been fantastic. Especially with, oh my god, so many putties. <laughs> like, this stack of enemies is worth, like, 1200 experience. Actually, no, probably more, because I think there's like five of them here. And if this game's, like, XP scaling wasn't so... Uh, excuse me. Excuse me. That was weird. Okay, yay. A splint helm? What does a splint helm do? Okay, it's a little bit worse, but I'm not sure if that's a... Okay, that's... This gives me 53 defense and I get a plus 4... A... Okay, let's say this gives me 57 defense. This one... Oh, it's just... It's useless to me! Okay. Make sure I'm on the right weapon. And let's keep going. Oh, I do not like this. I do not like this. <laughs> Please, stop with the... <laughs> Okay, no, I'm, I'm more or less fine with the putties, actually, just as a... Because, again, they give fantastic XP. Um, but again... Oh my god, why are there so many of them? Uh, uh, uh. Go away! I am none of your friend. 
none of your friend, honestly. I can see why this area would be excellent for grinding, especially since- oh no, here's more. Here's more of these guys just trundling through. And they- they attack you surprisingly quickly, so it's actually kind of difficult to... to, like, dodge around them and try not to get smacked. Are we done? No. The answer is no. The answer is never no. <laughs> no one stops. No one ever stops. Okay, let's do that. Uh, let's, let's spend one of those. Let's actually spend one of those as well. I'm out. But you know what? These guys, as long as they're not paralyzing me, aren't a problem. Which, it's actually more of a problem because, again, I'm melee, and paralysis stops me from moving around. And these guys, also jerks. Why? Can you, can you, first of all, can you stand in a position where I can hit you? That would be greatly appreciated. Um, yeah, I think I think for those guys, you just need to smack them as soon as you. S oh my God! Really? <laughs> the crossroad of dudes was such a good trick. We had to do it again. <sighs> uh, the I mean, the only problem here is that we're gonna get to like the hot as heck volcano, and it's gonna feel so weak. It's gonna be like, wait, they call this a level? I've already been annihilating putties. Oh wow. Um. Ah, <laughs> oh, I think it's I think it's almost time to start thinking about what my next uh my next level up's gonna be. Um I'm thinking that I am going to want to... I'm thinking s Spear, honestly. Uh, part of me is thinking I should still get efficac efficacy up. Because efficacy makes it so that I can actually heal more better. But honestly, we've not hit a point where the goddesses, not the goddess tears, the healing drops, um, cannot heal me pretty well. Also, man, are we are we done with are we done with these? No, you're not. <laughs> I I, can't, I feel like I keep asking this question, and the game goes, oh wait, no, we found another one. You wanted more, right? Oh wow, okay. Um Wasn't this like a boss at some point? I mean it's also a trapped behind the thing guy, so as long as we don't get hit by that slap, which I predict will really hurt. We should be fine, honestly. Like yeah, that was that was acceptable mostly because I cheesed. Actually, let me just test something. I'm just gonna use my soul. I'm gonna see how much damage it does in this dungeon. I haven't swapped it around, so it's still weird lady with her snake wolves. Um. Oh, so I'm looking over the time and I gave myself a scare. But the only reason why I gave myself a scare is because I started recording this and, oh my god. Okay. I was about to say, if it's more of those putty things, I will... I will get annoyed. Because <laughs> there's, like, identifying that you've got a 
neat trick. No. And then there's just spamming it. Come on. Join me in my uh, hallway of fun. Soup's hallway of fun. That's a way of thinking about it. Uh, let's cancel that. Oh, it, that, that, that's a decent amount of money. Not enough to make up for my heartbreak, but uh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let me, let me through, let me through, let me through, let me through, let me through. Okay, I didn't even need to be let through. Fantastic. And they give me an axe. Do I look like someone who appreciates the vagaries of axe use? Come on, come on. Yep. Oh, <laughs> uh, like, these guys look really intimidating, but as long as you keep your distance, they're not a threat. I, I think if I was using a short-range weapon... I would have had more difficulty there, but um, I'm gonna pop up here, and I'm immediately gonna use my my angel wing, because as you probably noticed, I'm out of everything. Let's go identify this broad axe, sell it. Oh, wow, that's. Why are the items that I'm finding such trash? Like, like, actually, legitimately, considering how difficult this dungeon is, why is it handing me items that are several dungeons out of date? Like, it's giving me XP as if I'm going through, like, the Demon Tower. But at the same time, it's giving me items like I'm going through I don't know the ship maybe I don't know it's just it's weird it feels like a very very weird balancing act because you'd think that this would also this would not just be the place you'd go for like sweet XP this is the place you go for like good items or at least like good crafting materials Oh. It's been a while since we've seen, like, this particular trap. <laughs> Which I think was actually just... just a trap this time. Because, yeah, unlike the... I think it was in Wizari's pa No, it was in the, the graveyard where there was an item there? Oh, I see. Uh... <laughs> That was just a, like, hey, welcome to the monster closet, population you. Oh, excuse me. Please don't trap me like that. Soup needs his personal space. Okay, so the... I was about to say, are we going to get the same thing of, like, gummy dudes in front, fairies behind? And, excuse me! Yeah, you! Guys! You're in the wrong spot! Also, I should probably heal. And there was literally nothing there. Like, that's, that's what feels so weird about this dungeon. Because in previous dungeons, they've been dropping a ton of items. This one? Not so much. Which is, again, weird, because these guys also hit, like, trains. <laughs> which, you know, is weird to s which actually feels a little bit weird to say, given that... I'm pretty sure I actually hit harder than they do. Um, it's just that... Yeah, there are also, like, four of them chasing me right now while I charge up ever so slowly. 
So another th nice thing I've noticed, and I'm not sure if you've noticed, you probably have. Also, wow. Okay. Um, it's just that I've been hitting the the dude limit, the limit on dudes. Um, but whenever my shield does something, it uh, actually. Oh, and I also dropped my shield. I was about to say my shield. The nice thing about my shield is that when it triggers, I don't take the damage. Um, or rather, like, even if the damage chips through, it doesn't disrupt my, like, the fact that I'm focusing on a weapon attack, which is actually a really nice perk. Um... Oh, right, they dropped me at the beginning of here. Oh, no. Oh, no. <sighs> okay, it doesn't respawn enemies. Oh, I'd forgotten that it doesn't respawn enemies, and for a second there, my like my heart skipped a beat because I have to run through this without a shield. And you know me, I need my shield. I need my security blanket. Also, hey, douche, douche, douche nozzle, friendarino, get get shanked on. I'll also take my money back. Okay, I just, I just want to see. Okay. So my defense with nothing on is uh, zero, obviously. The shield gives me 51 defense. The armor gives me 68. And the bronze helm gives me 53. My armor is so good, you guys. <laughs> so good. But now we need to figure out how... Where to go next? Um, I'm not entirely sure. Honestly. Because uh, we got this. We got, we got that. Can we continue going up? No, we cannot. Is there a secret passage? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, okay. I see how we're playing this. Oh, and it's just these golems. Golems, not a problem. Like, I would say that like they're basically just weaker versions of the putties. Um, it's just that then we have this bowling, like cannonball frog. Again, I don't know what's going on there. <laughs> And ooh, I think we are actually at the end of this dungeon. And we leveled up. Excellent. Let's go ahead and put stuff in there. And I said spear. Um, I think, yeah, spear is, spear is probably the best. One, I'm going to pop a healing item. I'm going to pop one of those. We're going to see what this this encounter looks like. <gasps> okay, it's like just, hey, we got a dragon? I hope you like it. The answer to that is, no, I don't, and I just wasted my item. Oh, crap. Uh... It not, it's not only like, hey, we got a dragon, how do you like this? It's that we have a dragon and you're, uh... You're in a shoebox. Uh, excuse me. <sighs> Nerd. Okay, we're we're actually gonna bust for the better healing item here, cause there is no way I'm letting some overgrown fire-breathing lizard take down soup. Game. What the actual... Oh no. Oh no. Uh, oh no. Oh no. Oh. I dropped my money. Okay, no, I either dropped my money... Or something else happened there. And, as you probably just noticed, 
I didn't have enough to buy, like, the really good stuff. Okay, let's try this again. Oh, I, I, I don't think I dropped my money exactly. I think they just decided, you know what? You must have spent it all somewhere. I probably did spend it all somewhere. Okay, let's see. Now that I just have the one of you, the one guy to deal with. Oh my god! Oh my god! That was so much easier! Huh! Huh! Ugh. Okay, I'm actually gonna check something before we do anything else. I'll be back in a second. Alright. It turns out that we have two more levels of the Colosseum to beat before we can get the next tier of awesome dungeon. So let's take a crack at that. Let's see how much Colosseum level 9 absolutely murders me. I hopefully, hopefully the answer is not very. Um, but oh boy. This game, that optional dungeon was uh, not playing around. Okay. Yeah, and like all the stuff we're gonna get here is kind of garbage. Okay, these are guys are fire guys. You can tell by the palette. Um, I kind of like that we're seeing those guys again in <gasps> dogs, puppies. Like, weird Cerberus puppies, but puppies all the same. Um, fire versions of those, of those lizards. So this is like more of like a spoiler for what's gonna be in in the next episode, really. Also, wow. Um, excuse me, my friends. Uh, no need to be so, so rude. Um... Three golems. Oh, now it's just like one of you? Huh. Um. I wonder if this is gonna be like a common enemy in the next one? Let me drop you. Okay, we go and we got the like. This is gonna permanently increase my intelligence, which is actually, it's actually pretty nice. Honestly, because I'm not spending intelligence on my. On my own stuff. I'm not spending it out of my own XP. Um, let's see if we can complete the next one. Because that will unlock the... The thing. And it's no shame if I can. Um... Okay. Oh, shoot. I, I wanted to look at what the items were. Um, but oh, it, it's also like these. So whatever dungeons after the after the volcano has these things in it. Oh, I'm not looking forward to that. <sighs> yeah, like it's so hard to hit you guys. Like not even in, not not in like a hey. Oh, yeah. Um. Let's just... Yeah, like, these guys, I'm not even sure what their their deal is, honestly. I'm not even, I don't think I'm gonna be able to beat this one just because I don't, my damage output isn't high enough. And oh my god, they can move. Okay. Um, I just thought I would test uh, the, how extreme the difference is. But like, yeah, these guys, um, I just don't deal enough damage to really beat them under the time limit? Ooh, these guys look... I don't like the look of these guys. Uh... Like, look at these, like, weird Reaper dudes. And these, like, weird... Everything just hits me with darkness! And, like, blind! What it... Why? Why is this a status effect? 
why is like night a status effect? And it's like yelling at me when it's like, hey, you need more training. I'm gonna just go in there one last time. Um, I'm not actually gonna do that one. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go in here. This gives me a yogurt doll, an elemental gloves, which look at those resistances. Those resistances are fantastic. And Raijin 3, which is really good. Um, does anyone, does anything here give us, is there, is there one here, because just to justify our entry fee, that gives me an item that I don't have yet? That one's actually kind of interesting. Uh, that's useless. Useless. Oh, critical hit plus four, that's interesting. Um... Look, look, look at look at all this fantastic garbage that I never got from the earlier ranks. Um, you know what? Let's school some nerds and end this episode just feeling big. First of all, nerds are be gone. Nerds be gone. Nerds be gone. And even these guys do the darkness cloud. Does it give me- no, it didn't give me the item I wanted. Alright, we're gonna do it one last time, because I want to get that attack speed up ring. And also that takes me less- literally less than 30 seconds. I wonder if they'll actually give you the herbs before you get all the special items, or like the, all the actual rewards. If they if they do that, I will be annoyed. <laughs> Cause that's that seems like a little bit of a well, like, that seems like that would be a little bit of a mechanical oversight if that was the case. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Oh, come on! I was gonna beat my time too. There we go, flash ring. Um, what was it, what was it, the exact thing this did? This gives me oh wait, it's like light resistance, which is kind of useless at this point. But attack speed plus two. You know what? I, I'm I'm gonna hold on to it. Uh, for a second there, I thought it was a little bit more exciting than it actually was. All right, let's let's go be a patron of the apothecary. Please. I need healing for my wounds. And let's end this. Forever. No. Um, we will be coming back soon-ish for Hadazek Volcano. Anyway, I'm Mappy. This has been Shining Soul 2. Just some side stuff. The Forgotten Dungeon. And I hope you enjoyed. Take care, and I will see you next time. Later.